I want to thank my mom for the strength she's been having to exhibit all this and just be strong, even though it's hard being in the house for 21 days, not knowing what's going to happen after she get out and stuff. But yeah, I, I hope y'all keep praying that my family is okay and my dad make it out safely. And thanks to um, the United States government president for sending people to Africa uh, that have the same disease my dad have to try to get better. I hope to find a cure for it. This is a medical issue, this is a safety issue, but it's also a human issue. There are human beings that are dealing with this issue. They're good human beings. Their heart is in the right place and, and their heart is breaking. I thank the Liberian community for being such an important part of Dallas County and the city of Dallas. Uh, all we want to know, uh, let you all know that uh, this Ebola virus is not a virus that you can get from just standing here and talking to a person. So we're just trying to let the public know that this, uh, they should not stigmatize the Liberians within the community because uh, not all Liberians, uh, it could be anybody, this uh, virus who uh, they could get. So our kids are being stigmatized, so we, we are trying to put the word out there for the, for the community and people around the world not to stigmatize uh, the librarians within the United States.